Fair Share is a charity that basically works with the food industry to take surplus food. It's perfectly fit for purpose, but that would otherwise go to landfill. And what we do is we send it to hostels and day centres and places where they can use it. We work with drop-in centres, we also work with some supporting housing units uh, where they're working with people who are recovering from addictions, basically anywhere where there's people who are suffering food poverty. Pies, pizzas, tomatoes, uh, cheese, ham, all sorts of stuff. <laughs> In the evening we feed most probably about 18, 90 people. So yeah, really, really busy in the evening. During the day about 60. We've had food from Fair Share now for about four months. And the food is so good. You know, we see some of our clients actually putting weight on because the quality of the food is so good. Tomorrow night, for instance, we're having roast potatoes, calved ham, and vegetables with gravy. We could never have done that before. By having Fair Share, they've actually helped us um, reduce our costs so that we can actually employ another worker, which is what we really needed. Well, it goes to anything from even pizzas to really steaks, you know, matter whatever, whatever they providers can provide, you guarantee it will be consumed, you know, it's as simple as that. And there are plenty of thankful people out there, that's the important thing. Fair share came along and I thought that's absolutely brilliant because it will help us to bring in healthy living and healthy diet but also concepts of helping the environment into the work that we do with young people. A lot of our volunteers are uh, looking for work and we can provide training, work experience for all our volunteers. The dry house that I'm in, um, I'm on one of the drops, so we get stuff on fair share and uh, just heard about looking for volunteers, so I decided to make myself useful. And the main reason for doing it, I suppose, is, I don't know, all my life I've taken from society and now I've got a chance to give something back for nothing, you know. Get to meet people, see a bit of Bristol. I think the importance of volunteering isn't just about getting the job done, although that's essential. Fair share would probably collapse without. It's also about helping those people make a positive contribution and, and help themselves uh, make a contribution in terms, of, in, in terms of, uh, of what they learn and what they gain through volunteering. You know, for myself, I, I, from being um, active addicts and sort of Harming others is about giving back to people. Yeah, it makes you feel good that that stuff's going to the right place, you know, not going in the dustbin. The payback for the community and the savings as far as the environment are concerned are huge. And so, you know, just by getting that extra capacity at fair share, um, you know, enables so much more benefit. It's, it's you know, out of all proportion. Last week we gave, we gave uh, steak, chips and onion rings. All sorts of food which, to be honest, we couldn't afford. Homeless people never see a steak. Seriously, they do steaks in here. They do all sorts of stuff. Yes. And to be honest, when they come in and they get a meal like that, it just blows them away. I'd like to say personally thank you to the, to the sort of supermarkets and the um, manufacturing people who actually help us in that way. Whoever contributes and donates to these premises, the people who receive it are very, very thankful about mm. it. Yeah. It's great, you know. There should be more companies like this in the world, you know. Spread the love.
and the food. <laughs>